Hi, I'm Sissy Sullivan. I'm Tracy Turner, and we are Sullivan Turner team at Maybaum Real Estate. And we are here today at 259 Lancaster Street Southwest in a fabulous location, walking distance to Aiken Downtown, walking distance to Aiken Golf Club, a great location to go biking or go out for a jog. I love this location. I am I actually measured it on the way here. So oh, it you is point five of a mile from the post office downtown. Oh wow. So ten minute walk. Yeah. And really a really nice lovely walk along the course to the woods from here too yes so this house has been renovated and it's a traditional ranch home but when you go inside which we can't wait to show you you're going to see a space that's been transformed uh, by the, the current owners so the home offers three bedrooms and two baths it's a little over 2000 2045 square feet and it sits on 0.46 of an acre. And it's a nice open grassy lot with some nice privacy along the back border. Yeah, there's plenty of room if you want to add a pool or just want to add some fencing for pets or do some raised garden beds. Um, there's a lot of opportunity to, to do more with this grassy lawn, but it's just fun to kick a soccer ball around too. Um, I can't so, say enough about the location there. Yeah, the location, the, location. the open living space, mm -hmm. the kitchen's awesome, and yes. the baths are awesome too. Couple nuts and bolts. We've got um, a generator. We've got a tankless water heater. Um, there is a newer metal, metal roof. Mm -hmm. um, so a lot of that, and gutters, and you know, one car garage. So I don't know, we just want to show you inside. One story living, just a few steps in. Yeah. So do you want to go inside? Absolutely. Let's go inside. <laughs> yeah. One of the things we love about the interior renovation that has been done here at 259 Lancaster Street is how the living spaces have a great flow and they're really versatile rooms. You can see here we have a dining room, which easily could be a living room. It has beautifully refinished hardwood floors. It's got a three uh, window, not a bay window, but almost um, here on the front to give in some natural light. And then one of the things that is fantastic in this house is all of the trim work. You can see the carpentry around that cased opening and uh, their wide cased openings, which again, make for really easy flow. So as we're here in what is currently the dining room, um, you can actually, there's so much uh, wall space and the scale of this room, you can again use it as a dining room or you could use it as a living, a more formal living room, whatever um, is great for your family and household. So we're gonna open here to the kitchen. So this is one of the, the openings that they expanded and they carried the millwork throughout the dining living space into the kitchen. This door actually goes to a one car garage and this kitchen has so many fun features. Um, so where to begin? Um, <laughs> you got your wine refrigerator and all these beautiful counters are quartzite counters. So you have this expansive counter space, which is fabulous. And then two really nice deep um, double sink there. You've got your Samsung uh, stainless steel dishwasher. And all these drawers are custom. They're the slow close. And you've got a really nice combination of your, your glass um, uppers and then your solid cabinetry here. Um, one of the other nice features just below your built-in microwave is the pantry. Um, so you have these nice pull-out drawers here. So those are fun. You get all the stuff in the way back. And then of course, I love this painted accent wall, um, this brick wall. I think that's a lot of fun and um, adds a lot of neat texture. And You've also got some neat texture going here with this really large subway kind of textured tile here. Um, you've got, of course, a wonderful, if you like to cook and you like your gas stove, you've got your five burner gas stove. This is a Cosmo stove. And then your venting, which is continues up and this nice 
custom millwork that um, that expands across the the front of the cabinetry, which is beautiful. And then it's you have another nice expanded um, opening into the sunroom um, with the same style custom millwork, so it transitions nicely. It's seamless, and you know Tracy mentioned this quartzite counter. Well, on this side, there's enough space, probably for four or five uh, bar stools. So you, it really makes it great for entertaining. You can imagine using this for a buffet. And again, you've got, or just, you know, kind of a casual lunch. You know, everyone comes over, you could see, um, you can have a little wine tasting at your, your bar. Uh, the sunroom is a really large room. Uh, we love rooms which offer light on three sides and this room does so uh, beautifully and one of the great touches in this renovation is they raise the ceilings to hold the ceiling fans so you get the benefit of the fan but it's raised above you and it's a really cool look here in the sunroom you can see uh, the renovation includes a lot of recessed lighting um, and they're on dimmers um, so you can really create a mood uh, with the lighting. Uh, the sunroom offers you awesome views of the backyard. Uh, this lot is actually, I think, a lot bigger than I expected it to be when I first came to this property. Uh, we have an old-fashioned vintage dinner bell. We're so, as we mentioned earlier, we're so close to Aiken Golf Club. I'm like, okay, it's time to come home, guys. Wrap it up on the 17th or 18th green and come on back for dinner. There's a screen gazebo and a storage shed as well. Um, there's some nuts and bolts out there that we'll talk about later. I love the, how the back has that nice privacy fence and that nice tree buffer, which really helps provide privacy along the, the back property line. Uh, then you have another nice flow right into this keeping room or TV den. If you use it how you wish right off of the kitchen. Um, a nice cozy fireplace that I do believe you could use as a gas fireplace. There is a gas line there um, and you could also, I believe, use that as wood burning. Um, a nice space here for your entertainment. And then this beautiful natural light that you have here. This is a wonderful skylight. So you don't need to turn on the lights, but as you can see going through the home, every surface has been touched. All the ceilings, walls, floors, all of that's been beautifully renovated. So we're back in the front entry foyer. We have a coat closet and we're gonna take you to the bedroom wing. So it's nicely recessed here and this closet here is to house your washer dryer and kind of be your laundry space. And after you come past it, you've got this nice wide vestibule and the bedrooms are off of this nice vestibule. Um, so the primary bedroom, um, again, is just clean and fresh with the refinished hardwood floors. It has two closets and it has, uh, both bathrooms have been beautifully renovated. They have marble tile floors. The primary has a glass enclosed shower that's really oversized with an oversized subway tile. And then this nice, vanity um, that has drawers because we all need drawers in our bathrooms and again a window uh, for some natural light here in the bathroom it's really a good space so i also wanted you to take a note you do have attic pull down stairs here so you have extra storage up there for for um, all those things you want to put away and then as you come back from the primary bedroom into this space, you have your nice hall bathroom here, which also I think gives you a little bit more of a buffer from the primary bedroom. There's beautiful marble tile floors there. And this hall bathroom uh, has a nice tub and shower. And the subway tile on this um, tub goes all the way up to the ceiling. So really nicely done and lots of really great cabinetry space here. So, um, and I love the, the colors. It's just a nice clean lines and, and um, very fresh and new and modern. 
Um, along the front, you have um, one of your guest bedrooms, and this is really lovely with the natural light on both the front and the side house. And one of the things I wanted to point out too, you've got these great big closets. Um, so they're, they're nice, but all the doors, um, both the closets and the doors, the bedrooms, all of those are new doors and just really nice craftsmanship throughout. The second guest bedroom around to your right also has some nice natural light along the front. The hardwood floors, the new hardwood floors are carried throughout the house. And then you also have those same fabulous doors on the closets there, as well as on your um, bedroom here. So really great third guest bedroom or office space, um, whichever you would want to use it as. Thank you for joining us today to take a tour of 259 Lancaster. So before we depart, we're gonna wrap it up. Well, we're, in, we're standing in one of my favorite rooms in the house. I love this kitchen, but besides this amazing, fabulous kitchen, three bedrooms, two baths, 2,045 square feet. The home sits on 0.46 of an acre. Location is fabulous, being walking distance to downtown, the Aiken Golf Club, Hitchcock Woods. How can it get any better than that? Yeah, half a mile to the post office. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a really great location, a great home. We'd love for you to come see it in person. Um, you can call our team at 803-998-0198.